wonderful weather of Illinois. It feels very good today. I'm actually waiting on a friend. I do Uber on the side before I go to my main job in the evening. Uh, God is good and I'm, I'm blessed to be here. Uh, like I said, a long time ago, or actually in February, I came with COVID and I was on uh, the breathing machines in the hospital for about 31 days. I was there for about a month, long time. And uh, I'm just grateful to God that it's over with and I'm home and um, I'm vaccinated and I take it more serious now. But anyway, what I was going to say is um, uh, I'm watching, uh, I'm going through my YouTube and Jay Wilson's lives up and he's explaining to everybody why he loses weight and what supplements he's taking, why everybody's jealous. And I'm thinking to myself, as a man, not, not gay, but as a man, you don't have to explain nothing what you do in your personal life. Why did you bring it up to YouTube? That's nobody's business. You lose weight because you want to. I don't understand how you have to get on here and explain Then you're going like this, showing your arms. You're not a bodybuilder, okay? You know, you lost a little weight, God bless you. But I mean, who cares? I mean, it's not a competition. You know, just be happy who you are. I mean, I, I don't know of any man who going on here have to explain himself why he's losing weight and what supplements he take because people are uh, jealous. The thing why people bring it up is because you bring it to the forefront. So when you bring it to the forefront and you get up on the camera and you walk off and they see your stomach, they're going to judge. That's the world we live in. If I sit here and brag about my hair, my hair, and it's all over my head, people are going to judge my head. That's the life. That's the world we live in. I never can understand how you just sitting there as a 52 year old man. You got to explain yourself. I wasn't fat in high school. I got fat in my 40s. So what? If you like to eat, you like to eat. Big deal. I don't understand uh, the logic. And, you know, I've uh, there are a lot of codes I've cracked in my life, you know, as far as personalities and people's traits. I, I, I can't understand your code. Uh, you claim to be a pastor, but yet you talk about every woman on YouTube like a dog. I noticed that uh, when, um, uh, boy, I forgot the dude's name uh, uh, that smokes a cigar on YouTube, but he, he, uh, he got tired of you talking about him. He said, I'm going to be in your town soon. I want us to meet up. Your next video you talked about for about an hour and a half, the power of the police department in San Antonio, Texas. And if anybody want to run up, well, I got the police on speed dial. I've never met a man, a, listen, a man. I've met a lot of gay people in my life. I've never met a man, just masculine male who's that scary. And no, I'm not trying to get no YouTube attention or what I'm just saying. I never understood how you could talk about everybody. And yet, as soon as somebody's come bring your name up, they either want attention, they jealous of you. Jealous of what? You know, uh, I know this daytime, you're still making videos at your uh, your kitchen table or living room table, wherever you're at in your house. Why, why aren't you at work? I mean, jealous for what, man? I mean, we, you got to go to another level, man. Okay. Um, uh, I don't care, Storm Chase. He could talk about me forever. I just think that, um, I just think that he's a sad person. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm very comfortable with who I am and what I do and how I live. I've never tried to be more than what I am or whatever. Uh, my, uh, my credit is 500 some. I'm trying to get it to 600. I'm not perfect. Um, trying to start a business. And listen, we all are trying to do something in life or whatever. It's just amazing to hear a man brag, brag, brag. And I go to the gym and I take them something. Look at my arms, y'all. Look at my arms. You know, you, you're not, you're not Hulk Hogan. You know, you don't have bodybuilders on regular arms. Then he talked about underneath the flab part of the arm. He said, I think, was it Bless Watkins? He said some name. I think it was Bless Watkins. Talked about she had extra flab on her arm. It's like, why are you judging all these women? And, you know, I want the LBGT community to ask, I mean, to this question, is that a gay trait to talk uh, for a, a gay man to always talk about women all the time? Please explain that to me because I don't understand that. You know, uh, uh, I mean, you know, I think his best bet, just come on here with sweaters for about six months and then do a reveal where you really lost all the weight. Because you ain't did nothing yet. 
you do like a, and I won't ever say a name, but a relative of mine. She got gung-ho for the gym, started posting pictures of the gym, but ain't lost five pounds. You know, that's, I mean, that's not bragging, man. Just, you know, just come to another level. You know, try to come on YouTube without talking about women all the time. I remember when you was going ham on 5A, ham on Tracy, and y'all, even though you and Tracy made up, and now I hear you talking about Bless Watkins. I heard you talk about uh, Brianna Simone in the past or whatever. And uh, it's like, who, what woman do you really like? I ain't talking about no mods or people on your page, part of your crew, but I mean, what woman do you really like? You, I mean, I'm starting to buy what Five Babe said a long time ago. And you all notice I said a long time ago, so I don't want to start no beef. But she said it's like you hate women. Every time you look around, you're talking about women, women, women. Dude, is there a hatred for women? I don't know if that's a um I don't know if that's a gay trade or what, but you talk about women like dog. If you all are watching this, please hit the thumbs up or whatever. But I, I don't understand how every time a woman on YouTube, you, you talk about them, 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 talk about them. But the two men, the two men, uh, 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 Larry Nelson and uh, you all, chime in, who is the dude who smokes the cigar on here? I forgot his name. I, I don't be on YouTube like that no more. Uh, the, the two men that uh, 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 said they want to see you face to face, you immediately start, made a video talking about the police. I know you start talking about my house, carpet on my walls, this, that, that. I said, you know what? We grown men. I'm going to see you face to face. I said, we're going to see each other very soon. You made a, a scared video. Ooh, ooh we, we, we got to, uh, uh, I got to go to, uh, 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 let's talk about the police. The police force in San Antonio, they don't play, honey. They come out, I got them on speed dial. What you got the cops on speed dial for? I got some uh, uh, head busting cops here. I don't have them on speed. Now, for what? I'm a man. Um, you know, ain't nobody finna come to my house and do nothing. So, what do I got them on speed now for? I'm not a, a lawbreaker. So, what I got them on speed now for? All I'm saying, man, is just go to another level, man. You, you, you take stuff to the extreme, man. Leave these women alone on YouTube. And I keep saying that because you take it to the extreme, man. You take it to the, uh, you take it to the max, man. You talk about women on here all the time. I don't understand why nobody won't chime in, in in my comment section, Larry. You're right. I mean, because you 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 act like you just hate women. What is the problem, man? What is the problem? You know, and then you talk about people, you don't talk to people that lies all the time. Okay, uh, if I want to bring up lies, okay. You uh start growing the hair out, then all of a sudden those ball patches of yours was full spray on and uh, uh all of a sudden you say huh my hair growing out i didn't know it could do that because i kept it bald all the time why would a man who couldn't grow hair all of a sudden it can't grow and then he goes back bald don't make sense i guarantee you, if michael jordan could grow hair because he grow bald uh as soon as he got out of college as soon as he got to the NBA, like second year it was thin uh all of a sudden he's uh I guarantee if his hair could grow, he would be having an afro or something, long hair or something, because that's, I mean, it's just like a man who can't grow facial hair or whatever. If if you could grow it, shoot, you're going to have a beard, a goatee, uh, a little connection. You're going to have something because that's what men like to do. And all of a sudden, yours is cut back ball. You you know, you, um, uh, I, I just, I just don't understand, man. You just talk about everybody, but. Uh, all these women, but anyway, my whole point is um, just move to another level, man, because it's, it's like if that's all you're known for and then you're going by the title, Pastor, you need to take that out of your title because you make God look like a, a, a plump fool. Listen to me good. You make God look like a plump fool. You talk about everybody and then you turn around um, and then you turn around and uh, um, uh, 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 claim you're a, a pastor. You know, to you, it's like a joke. That's what they call me. No, you call yourself something else, man. But leave God out of the title if you want to play with him. I'm a Christian, but I've made many mistakes on YouTube. Many mistakes. I made myself like a plump fool. I ain't going around Christian Larry. Christian Larry. No, what you have to do is just 
rebuild yourself and, 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 and change how you were. You haven't changed nothing, man. You talk about everybody, everything. And then I'm sure you're going to comment, Larry Nelson just wants some attention. He just wants some attention. I don't need no attention. I'm just saying, grow up, man. Grow up. You don't have to make no video showing your arms. Look at my arms, y'all. It ain't. Look at my arms, y'all. It ain't flabby. Ain't nothing flab on that. Ain't nothing flab on the mind. But I, I, ain't, I, ain't, I don't have to come on here and do that. I don't have to come on YouTube to do that, man. Let's grow up and go to another level, okay? I don't know why I'm saying it because at 52 years old, I would have thought that you were way up there. I don't know, man. It's, it's just sad after not being on YouTube in so long. I mean, as far as me watching all the beef sector, you're still doing the same thing. The same thing. I want to brag about I want to brag, and then you want to brag Bless Watkins' arm or something about her back arm got jelly and that turkey neck and is hung. Come on, man. Who are you? Who are you? I, w I would love to interview your daddy. I know mom is deceased. I'm not going to disrespect. I would love to interview your daddy and your sister to see what type of person were you growing up. Because if you was femme, you took the you took the mannerism of a girl all your life. I know where your mannerisms come from. But I'm saying as far as a man, dude, what did dad teach you? You talk about women all the time, man. Come on, dude. Go to another level, man. That's getting stupid. I'm going to get off here, you all. I just want to vent and say that. Um, I was watching uh, his live came through and I, I watched it for a few minutes where he bragged about the supplements he take and honey, I'm taking all them supplements and you know, who, who cares? Just do it. Do it. You know, um, I don't know. I just, I just, I just think that you would be on another level and uh, somebody just said you dragged the hell out of Von Vaughn. I want to say this to you. Uh, read the gummy mouth crackhead of Philly. Uh, I want to say this to you. When I read her or, or whatever you call it, my whole thing was this. That woman came out the blue crying, talking about me like a dog or whatever. Tried to make me look like some freak nasty dog. OK, so if you're going to quote that, say the whole thing. OK, and as far as Vonnie is concerned, I wish her... Um, Nothing but I, I pray to God she pay her debts because she I know she had a lawsuit that was all over YouTube. Uh, I know she got off YouTube simply because uh, pictures of her son and her sister was up there. Now, see, as long as you're reading her, you know, she didn't got used to the dog, the, the dog, out, even though she would cuss everybody out in the next video about it. She got used to it. But when her sister and her son come to it, why, why people talking about me on YouTube because of her? She said, let me shut my page down. This is the only way it can go away. So that was the whole th thing about that. I have nothing against her except that she tried to build her YouTube fame up by talking about me. And uh, that's that's the thing. But I, 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 I would hope that she's in a better place or whatever. You know, anybody who sit there and go to my YouTube page or Facebook page to uh, uh uh, uh, indoctrinate a daughter I didn't raise uh, simply because she grew up in Texas and, and I'm in Illinois. Um, hey, hey, we got some news about your dad here. Here, we'll pay you $801 to talk about him. $801. We'll say it's for therapy. <laughs> she went shopping. I wish I could have got some of that money, though. But anyway, God bless you all. Uh, Jay. I know you watch the videos, even though you say somebody told me. No, you watch them. Grow up, man. You, 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 you 52 years old. 52, man. Or are you going to be doing reads at 60? And bless walkers and, and five, eight. It's getting old, dude. Grow up. But anyway, God bless you all. Keep me in your prayers as I do the same. I'm not trying to be a part of no beef sector. Uh, uh, read the crackhead. Read the gummy mouth crackhead said I dragged Crystal Salter too. Uh, you keep on bringing up people who said my name first. If you're gonna say something, uh, read the crackhead. I just say uh, read the gummy. Say the whole truth. 
This was a woman sitting there saying, uh huh, I know the truth about Larry. She built her page up. Nobody knew who uh, 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 Vonnie was. She built my, her name about talking about me. When I first met Jay Wilson, he had maybe 800 uh, viewers. He built his name up talking about me. I could be on here every day and build up viewership. It's not really that serious to me no more because I do have a life outside of that. And like I said, I'm trying to start a business. I'm not trying to turn my house into an Airbnb. I want to walk around my house naked if I want to, three o'clock in the morning. You can't do that when people live with you. Uh, I want to go in the living room and watch what I want to watch on my TV when I want to. Uh, that's that. But anyway, uh, Jay Wilson, dude, you got to be better than that, man. And and I would just tell you, man, listen, change your name on YouTube and take that passa off your name because you make God look like a bumbling fool. I didn't say he was. I said you make Christianity and everything look like a bumbling fool. It's not about nobody judging you. Are you are you saved and gay? You know, uh, 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 everybody has an opinion about that, but I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about you. You sitting there. Um, thank you, speechless. Thank you. Nobody ever says that. Thank you, speechless. But I'm just saying, Jay, you you talk about everybody. You talk about everybody, man. Come on, dude. You way better than that. How long are we gonna do that, man? How long are we gonna go on this beef stuff? You so, man. You 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 way too old for that. You, and then you always dragging women. But the two men who, uh, uh, I forgot, they type in that guy's name that smoked the cigars on YouTube. Um, uh, uh, that said he wants to meet Jay Wilson when he come to uh, San Antonio. I forgot his name, uh, Ron, or was it Ron something? I'm, I, I don't follow this beef sector no more. But anyway, he said he was going to meet you, and you you made an hour-long video about the San Antonio Police Department. Yeah, I know it's jokes and gags, uh, read the gummy. What I'm saying, um, you said it's a uh, um, um, you saying it's about a, it's roasting gags, but where I live at, ain't nobody 52 years old. That dude's at the halfway mark of death. If you live a full life, he ain't gonna live to be 104, I'm just saying. You know, you too old for that. You roasting and getting, somebody will kill you. Listen, everybody can't handle being talked about on nationwide platform, aka YouTube. Somebody will kill you. Somebody will kill you. Daryl Moore, thank you, Texas Media News. Daryl Moore, uh, made a video and he said, Jay Wilson, I'm going to be in your town. I want to see you. We're going to talk face to face as men. He said as men, we're going to talk. Jay Wilson turned around, made an hour long video talking about the San Antonio police. We ain't got nothing to talk about. Why are you scared to meet up with a man? Why are you scared to meet up with a man? I did the same thing. I said, we're going to talk like men. I want to see you face to face. I want to see if the same energy is face to face. You made an hour and a half long video for me. And I ain't nobody. Daryl Moore was puffing that cigar and said, I'm going to see you. You got scared. Dude, you need to grow up, man. Because, see, the reason I say the reason you need to grow up is this. I said I was going to meet you, and I was partly just talking, mostly ready to come. Daryl Moore came. You didn't want to meet up with him. Somebody you're going to roast and gag. It may be somebody's uncle. Or somebody's niece, because you roast and gag women. It's gonna be some woman who say, uh, "Yeah, he lived right there in San Antonio." Somebody will get with your program, and you better be careful, dude. Be careful. Somebody will hurt you, man. I don't understand. Well, I do understand because you have the nature of a girl. That's why you always doing like that. And honey, I lost the weight, girl. I don't know no fifty-two year old man to talk like that, but you know. And uh, I've known some gays that. Uh, when they fight you, they put pink gloves on and they go boxing. That lets everybody know you got whooped by gay. You don't even have that in you. Dude, grow up, man. Grow up. Somebody will hurt you, man. This YouTube stuff, uh, uh, I'm, I'm trying to read this. Some dude just said something. Larry, you don't want to meet Jay Wilson. You just like beefing with him. 
Why do you say that? Uh, read the gummy. See, you read into stuff. Um, I ain't scared. I fear no man but God, and God is not a man. He's a spirit. I fear no one but God. Trust me on that. It ain't about me meeting. See, and this is what you, this is what, what makes you dumb, Philly, whatever your name is. Um, I don't have a problem meeting him. I just want to see if he got that same energy. He don't talk about me now. I'm just saying back then, I just want to see if he got that same energy now that he had then. You know, I mean, I figure if you go, see, you all, I don't know what parts of the country everybody's from. Wherever you're from, I'm from a place where if you're going to talk about somebody, talk to them. My, my brother does this, okay? We're not going to argue on the phone. We're going to see each other face to face. You know? Yeah, uh, thank you, uh, Sesame Street. Sesame Street. Um, that's my whole thing. My, my brother, uh, I have one brother in this world. My brother, uh, he turned around and he'll tell you, I'm not going, I'm not arguing on the phone. We either go see each other face to face or you're going to shut up and we, we stop talking on the phone. He doesn't do that argue on the phone, that lip, we call that lip boxing here. And I call it the same thing on YouTube, lip boxing. Ain't nobody going to see the other person. To me, that's a coward. That's a coward. If I'm going to talk about, uh, if I'm going to uh, uh, talk about, uh, Bri I use Brianna Simone. She's talked about me like a dog in the past. I believe tonight. I believe tonight. But anyway, uh, uh, one thing about it, once you ask her this, why, why, why aren't you still talking about justice for Tanaya? I'm still out. <laughs> because it's all, it was all it was, well, I ain't gonna even go off into that that's, that's history but anyway um, I'm not gonna talk about somebody I'm scared to see them face to face you know I should be able to say the same thing in a person's face that I say behind their back but anyway I'm gonna get off here it's uh, starting to get a little hot out here God bless you all Jay Wilson go to another level man take the name take the name pass off your title okay uh, uh, that, that, that right there to me you making God, you making a mockery out of God and the things of God, but uh, uh, I'm not beefing. Read the gun. I'm just talking about a man who 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 helped start his page by talking about me. I I don't I don't have an opinion. I don't have an opinion. Everybody always want to say, well, you said Jay Wilson's name, but nobody ever says who, the names he's called all the time. All these women. Uh, but anyway, hit the like button. You know, God bless you all. I'm out. Peace.